All right, fourth fight of the night, fight night number three. Oh, cast we got Alexander Abali and uh, Jaco Madrona. Jaco Madrona is the one with the uh, kind of grayish or lighter trunks. He's the one who just did that kick. And uh, his opponent, Abali, Black Tiger trunks. Ooh, what a heavy kick right there, right away. Abali and Madrona. Abali representing uh, Yasha Delic in the Thomas MMA and Madrona Sprawl MMA. Mm. That's a sidestep right there by Madrona. Mm. What a good kick. Oh, unless it looks good, but that kick, wow! Ang masasabi ko lang, ang hapde, ang hapde ng uh, sipa na yun. You know, after this, that guy is gonna feel it. Now he is on top. Abale. Madrona trying to minimize the space. Abale trying to go near his coach. Turned it around. Uh oh, he's now on top. Madrona, ang ating binatang Filipino, he's now on top. Sometimes I don't understand. I mean, does the, the fighter even hear their coaches when they shout like that all at the same time? Someone answered that question. Anyway, Madrona now standing. And that kicks. Sasakit mo mga sipa na yun. Yung buelo eh. Sakit talaga yung mga sipa. Oh, good one. Abali again on top. And he's pounding. Oh. That's round one. Alright, round number two. Action once again. Fight night three. Gage Gladiators and Hitman MMA Fight Night number three. Florence Cisebio is our referee. We're looking at Alexander Abalie and uh, Jaco Madrona. Oh, now Abalie was able to see that kick coming and he countered with a right straight. Let's see once again if uh, Madrona will try that kick. That was successful actually. Those kicks were successful in the first round. Uh, Bali maybe adjusted to it. We will see. Let's see what else Madonna has to offer. And he do. Does that and he Oh! Oh my man! What a body slam! I can hear that. From Polo to Batanes, that will hurt later. Abali now with those knees, he's jumping and flying. Oh, wow. he got the neck it's a stronghold it is a very stronghold oh stop out Alexander 
Valle wins this one. Wow. Palcast Sports.